of life existing elsewhere in the solar system has always captured the imagination of mankind. And for many years, Mars has been considered the ideal candidate by scientists to set up a future space colony. Recently, a four-member crew was welcomed with an applause at NASA's Johnson Space Center in Houston, Texas, after completing their one-year stay in a simulated Mars habitat to study and conduct experiments. As part of the first crew health and performance exploration analog mission, the team of Kelly Haston, Anka Celario, Ross Brockwell, and Nathan Joan ventured to their 3D printed habitat back on June of 20, June 25th, 2023. During the one year stay, the crew was subject to simulated life and resource limitations. This includes growing vegetables on the red planet, going on Mars walks and handling communication delays with Earth. Julie Kramer White, director of engineering at the Johnson Space Center said that there is still a lot to learn and also announced two more CHAPIA missions planned in 2025 and 2027. Outstanding. Awesome. Stay tuned for CHAPIA Mission 2, which will happen next year, and CHAPIA Mission 3, which will happen in 2027. We still have a lot left to learn, and we hope you'll join us on our journey. Please join me once more in welcoming CHAPIA Mission 1 crew home. In the past, multiple missions to the Red Planet has revealed traces of life during the early years of the Red Planet. However, only unmanned space rovers have been sent to Mars for studying its soil and atmosphere. But in the future, a manned mission to Mars could well be right around the corner. For all the latest news, download the WeOn app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.